Guys, it's time to clash with Chicken. In today's video, guys, we're going to be going over the two-fold lance. We're going to unlock this at level one and just go over whether it's worth uh, having or not. So how this item works is after destroying a target, um, after destroying a target, it hits a second target behind it with 30% of full damage. Now, it, when you, we compare this, whoa, when we compare this two-fold lance to our current um, power lance, the Power Lance damages adjacent squares with 20% damage. Uh, I don't have gold for that one right now, but um, let's go ahead and swap. Now, I think out of the two of these, I would suggest going with the Power Lance, simply because it does something similar to splash damage, which just means it's going to uh, hit multiple buildings. Um, the two-fold Lance is good. It's definitely better than nothing. Um, but having, uh, you're, you're still, the problem, with the, the, the biggest problem with the Prince is that he's stuck in that straight line. So, it really just kind of, um, you know, it's, it's, it's like a rage spell for the Prince almost, right? It's like it's going to make him better when he's in a good position, but it's going to make it that much more painful when they, uh, when they inevitably run into walls or to empty spaces or to, into things like that. So, let's, uh, let's take him for a ride. Let's take him for a ride. <laughs> the, the, his, his new thing looks funny. Let's get a screen grab of that. Um, okay, we got rockets. We got uh, we got nothing really good here. Eh? All right, let's go wizards. Nothing bad. Perfect. We're gonna be able to use it right off the start. One, two. Okay, that wasn't bad. That wasn't as bad as I was expecting. Um, got a lot of barbarians here. Eh? I think if we um, so if I use this wizard, he's gonna move up one. Yeah, let's let's do that. And then we're going to get a nice, uh, oh, well, uh, what if we go like this? Now we got him, I think, right? Yeah, eight times. That's going to take care of everything pretty well. Boom. Awesome. Yeah, I realized the, uh, the bug was fixed with the barbarians. I, I, I meant to say in, the, in yesterday's video that, um, the rage sword, it's still the best item, in my opinion, for the barbarians. So you can't really go wrong with that one right now. Let's go, wizards, melt all that stuff. All right, we got some nice giants in the center. Let's go ahead with the prince over here and just take that down. I think the wall is going to get burnt away with the burning damage here. In a sec, maybe, maybe. Um, okay, what do we want to do here, chicken? I think let's go prince. And next we'll go wizards. Get that expo out of the way. Now, worst case, we can use our rockets, but let's try not to have to use them. Oh, no, that was not good. Um, okay, we'll go Prince here. I got nothing to use these. Uh, I got nothing to use this stuff on. All right, let's try Wizards. Try one more Wizard. That at least takes that one down, but now we're going to have to use both of our rockets. <laughs> we got nothing left. We got nothing left. All right, we'll use both our rockets there. Boom. Next level unlocked. Oh, cool. That's all we needed to do to keep progressing anyways. All right, let's dive into the next one. Let's dive into it. Now, switching between the Prince items, if we went from the two-fold lance to the... Um, I'm drawing a blank here. The other one, I I, I don't think that's going to make a huge difference in terms of battles, but it's definitely... Um, you know, I think it's definitely a little bit better, so... Let's try not to use our items right away. I kind of could fall into that habit. Let's wait and see if we can get a decent combo here. Um, well, let's go ahead and use the item, I guess. Yeah, that was worth it, I think. Oh, we got a nice archer combo here. We got the quick shot archers. So they, they should get some extra shots. That was beautiful. Beautiful stuff. Let's go rocket in the back to start things off. And we'll go barbarians just to open up the walls, get some easy kills. Um, let's move up the barb. Get those double giants. Now, so now we got healing giants everywhere, which is going to be awesome. Other than the goblins, anyways. Alright, let's go barbarians here. Man, those wizard towers have some, uh, have some health, eh? Okay, let's go... You right there. 
And I guess we'll go... That's some stuff. I'm going to try to keep the Giants. If we can spend the rest of our troops and take this down, I think that's going to be worth doing. Ouch. Keep the Giants for the next rotation. One. I think we're, we're almost going to have to use all of them. Oh, no. If I have to use the Giant at the end? <laughs> we, we just kept him alive. Okay. All right. So now we got four Healing Giants. And we got nothing else. But we'll get more damage this way on, on this stage, I guess. So... Not too unhappy with that. Even though we only got one mortar down. It's all we needed. It's all we needed. Boom. 844 and two stars. Let's see here. I don't know. Maybe we'll be able to uh, get through Magma Bank. If we get a lucky roll. Ah, where do we want to go here? Let's start off with... <clears throat> Let's go with these archers. Maybe we'll get a nice barb. Wizards out of the way. Just trying to get a nice barb combo, if we can. Also, it would be nice to get those giants together. So, the barbarians with the rage, the more damage they take, the, 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 the more damage they do. This should be enough to finish without being overkill, I think. Nope, not enough for that one stupid wizard tower. Okay, let's go. Trip archers. Um, I guess we'll go barbarians. Oh, there's only a double stage. That's why this one's so hard. I was worried there for a sec. One, two... But we got to take half of the other stage down. I don't see that happening. Let's go with the Giants. And Archer finished off. There we go. Not ideal. Not ideal at all, but... Uh, it is what it is, right? So let's go Inferno. And Inferno. And we'll move these guys up. Use them. Barbarians are not going to be able to do squat. Oh, apparently there was two of them. Okay. Now, I, th I assume we need to get 50% here to take it down. I don't think we did. Oh. Oh, we only need to get the first stage. Cool. There we go. Yo, it's a boss fight. Whoa! It's Lava Golem! The arms look like they might come off. If we want to take it down, we need to focus on the body. So that basically means um, we want to shoot everywhere on him. So let's get things started off with a nice fireball. Open up those walls. Um, let's try to move our guys around. A well, I hate starting off without a combo because then it just puts you in kind of a bad position the rest of the match. So let's go like this. I don't think he's going to be this hard. As long as we get a couple decent combos, we should be fine to take him down. Uh, let's go goblins. That wasn't very good. There we go. Nice prince combo. That's going to be helpful. That was somewhat decent. Let's use the goblins since they're going to die. One, two, three, four. Ouch. Ouch. Uh, let's go with the uh, two-fold lance. Get some nice wizards in the back. I'm worried about the troops in the front, though, because they're all going to die next turn, I think. Okay. His health is going down pretty quick. And so are our troop reserves. Let's go like this. Now, I think we actually have to hit him in the middle for his health to go down. But I think if we take his arms down, then... Um, yeah, that's what it is. Then his hand, uh, can't fire anymore. Something like that. Alright, let's go Giants. Give him a smack in the gut. We're gonna be just short. Just short. And they're gonna go for his hands. Alright, well, that's okay. That's okay. This will be a tutorial on how to do this, because we can, uh, we can get him for sure, I, I I'm thinking. Alright, so all we gotta do is just get a good run with some nice combos, and I think we'll be okay here. And... Okay. Nice little start. He took some damage there too, which is good. Um... <clears throat> Alright, so where we wanna go 
is right about here. That's going to deal some damage to him. And now we want to do... So basically when his arms are down, that's when you want to do like more area damage. And you want to focus your princes into the center. So ideally if we can get all of our single target damage rated right as core. And then use our, uh, our splash damage for everything else to hit kind of both. That's the way we want to do this. Um, okay, I want to be careful here. I'm just kind of wasting the goblins. Okay, there we go. So now is where we want to do the power moves. So let's go like this. One, two. I know we wasted Prince, but I still think that was kind of worth it. Now we got our nice splash damage setups. Let's do that. So you see what I mean right there? It's going to hit his hands, but it's also going to... Uh, don't hit, don't kill my goblins. No, we had a nice goblin combo. Um, okay, let's try this. Yeah, it's all about the princes. It's all about the princes. Hmm. Yeah, let's go goblins. His hands have so much health, it's hard to, uh... Yeah, it's hard to come back from that. Uh, I think this prince will hit... Yes. Let's go goblins over here. Yeah, it's almost like you want to wait for him to do this, and that's when you want to send all the all the troops in. Ouch, ouch. And I want to keep my giants alive if we can. This prince is kind of screwed anyway, so we'll use a turn there. And hopefully our giants heal up. Yeah, see right now is where we want to use... Uh, we can use the wizards. Come on, giants, heal yourselves. Ah, he didn't stand up. He didn't stand up. If he stood up, we would have had him. Well, either way, that's the Lava Golem, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. As always, make sure to subscribe to the channel. We are posting Clash Quest each and every single day as soon as it goes live. It will be announced here, so make sure you stay subscribed and tuned in and all that good stuff. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching. That is going to wrap it up for the video today. Make sure to leave a like if you found it interesting, entertaining, or informative. And we'll see you next one, guys. Chicken out. Bear, bear.